Hi guys, um, I'm coming at you today with a birthday haul. So it was my birthday on March 9th. I'm a Pisces. So, you know, shout out to all the Pisces queens out there and kings and just Pisces peeps in general. Um, today I have a haul for you. I just picked up a few things. It's kind of like a collective haul from multiple places. Uh, I did Sephora, Ulta. I also got my, um, my Viva makeup in from Jamie, Genevieve and all that. So I have just a bunch of goodies from like multiple places and whatnot. I'm really excited because, you know, I went crazy because it's my birthday month and as one does during the birthday month, so yeah, let me start off with this super, super cute um, makeup bag. Look at it. It's like so cute. This order here is from Sephora. I just got it in today. Um, yeah, it's like super cute. It has like the cheetah print and then like a shell and like the gold details. And then look at this. So cute. Like that tortoise. It has multiple prints. And like that snake kind of skin. It's like super cute. This is from Sephora Collection. I think it's uh, Brother Velis for Sephora. And so I'm going to open up here and show you guys like all the goodies. And like it has this really cute like tan. And you open it up like this. It's really nice. Um. So yeah, look okay. at it's basically, yeah, Brother Valise X Sephora. Super cute. I really recommend any of the bags. He has two more. And honestly, they're super duper cute. So, uh, yeah, let me show you what I got today in that order. So, I ordered a Orbe uh, Gold Less Nourishing Hair Oil. I needed, sorry guys, keep knocking things out of my way here. I needed um, a backup because I'm using the Olaplex oil right now and yeah, the bonding oil and I wanted to get something different because I have really like confusing, annoying hair and winter is not helping. Like I said in the past, I had dreads for a few years and so I'm on a hair repair journey and I'm just trying different products. And that's what that looks like. It's the Gold Dust Nourishing Hair Oil, if I didn't say that. Really luxe packaging. I did get that scalp um, line shampoo and conditioner in the past haul that I did. And that, honestly, I don't even think it's working. Like, um, my scalp is super dry. I added some oil, so that's why my hair looks, like, really greasy today. It's gross. I'm sorry. I don't like it. I, I apologize. This is just the way things are going to be looking here. See, I don't even know, like, what to do with my hair. Like, it's so annoying. Anyway, yeah, so this is one of the things I got in. I'm going to try it out, and I will report back. And next up, I did get another one of these Grande Lash MD. I'm trying to um, help my lashes because I, um, I did lash extensions, and then I did um, a lash lift and my lashes are just not good right now. And so, um, yeah, I got this serum. I've been trying it out here and there. Hopefully um, it works. People say it works with consistent use. So we shall see about that. Next up, I did get a NARS um, Air Matte Blush. And this is in the shade Gasp. And I can show you a swatch. So this is basically how this comes. Look okay. It's really cute. As we know already, if we watch any of these videos that I've been doing. It's like a bronze, rosy kind of color up my alley. Those are the colors that I like. Ooh, yes. This is like the Rare Beauty uh, melty, Melting Cream Blushes. It's kind of that formula. That's what it reminds me of. And the color is stunning. I, I think I'm going to really like that. So yeah, excited. So excited to try that. So I'm going to see how that goes. 
basically um i'm just getting things out of my way here next up i got myself a new um spf i use the tatcha um pore perfecting spf i've been using that for like i don't know five years more than that maybe so this is the new say sun visor broad spectrum spf 35 sheer moisturizer i want to see because my skin is really dry and flaky and it hates me it's just not doing well these days in the winter so yeah i don't know let me see how that consistency feels hmm so basically this is how it comes a little squeezy tube really nice packaging hmm it feels nice oh yes that's like that glowiness thing it has like a pink tint to it but it blends in and it does feel like really dewy and moisturizing so let's see how i like that we shall see we shall see let's see here i'm sorry i'm wiping away as i go next up in that order i did pick up also um, what did i get oh yeah i got a sample of the lord jones um acid mantle repair this is a cbd moisturizer again i needed something for my skin that you know will help the dryness same with this this is just a sample and skin fix barrier triple lipid boost i've heard good things so i'm gonna try these out this one is good i tried it twice already and i like it so i'm gonna keep trying it and if i like it i'll buy the full price it's really expensive though so yeah we gotta try her before we bite that bullet next up i did get let's see oh i'll show you this i got this merit uh, lip oil in all natural so I wanted to try this brand. I try. I have a blush from them. Oh yeah, you know what? Let me show you that. I got that the other day too. Let me see if I'm able to find that. Because if I can't find it, well then I cannot show you. Mm, I think I don't know where that's at right now. So I'll show you guys next time. But yeah, I got the terracotta in that blush. And then, um, so this is the all natural lip oil. Let me see. The Merit All Natural Lip Oil. Look at it. Very nice packaging. I think I'm really, really going to love that. You know, it's like the perfect uh, tone. I'm going to move you guys just a little because, well, we need to get acquainted here. Gather ourselves. I don't know where I left that, as a matter of fact. Oh, yeah. Hold on, guys. I will show you. I, I know it's here. Sorry. You know, just gotta do what you gotta do. Anywho. So yeah, like I was saying though, this is that Merit uh, terracotta blush that I got the other day. It's also a very delicious kind of shade. So, so there's the blush. It's very, very sheer, I will say, very sheer. And there's the lip oil in All Natural Terracotta and all natural very very beautiful products i i did enjoy that blush i've used it a couple times i've been liking it and then next i did get a charlotte tilbury ice to mesmerize in star gold i wanted to check these out since forever and i finally bit the bullet because like i said why not it's your birthday girl so go shorty it's a birthday and i really did go go hard and so this is in star gold if i did not say that beautiful luxe typical charlotte packaging because well as we know how charlotte does things she's a queen and she does things queen style it's just a beautiful like warm bronzy gold I, I'm gonna love that. I mean, it's a typical shade that I would enjoy all the way through. And then next, I did get also in this order a um 
a Tower 28 bronzer. I've been wanting to try it, and since I picked up the new blush shades, I figured I would get I would get um the bronzer in West Coast. I wanted to try this since like forever, but I didn't think it was for me. But I did pick up those other ones, the blushes. So I figured, why not? Let's let's give it a whirl. It's just very like shiny, like just yeah, like a bronzy kind of sheer shiny tint shade there. It's very nice, I will say. I don't know if I showed you guys that Tower 28 blush though. Honestly, I don't know. I think I might have. I'll show you now though, just in case. So that's, so that's the, oh yeah, I did show you guys. So this is a new shade. I have Happy Hour and Golden Hour. And then this is the one in Power Hour. And I did show you guys this last time. I believe so. And there is that right there. So that's the Power Hour. Very beautiful. Lux, Lux, Lux. Next, I also picked up from that order a scent. This is in the Clean Reserve Radiant Nectar. So if you like honey, like sweet, sweet, sweet scents, you're going to love this. This is my second bottle. I love it for spring and summer. It's just like, it's like gorgeous. They describe it as a floral musk. So I got that and I love that. And then, excuse my beauty blender, but I picked this up. It's a Pisces beauty blender. So they came out with a bunch of the horoscope ones. And look at that. So cute. So, so cute. It's a little dirty though. And next, I did pick up something very beautiful and very luxe by Jo Malone. This is the Nectarine Blossom and Honey. And again, very floral and sweet. And look at this. Oh my God, it came in here. This is so, so good, you guys, so good. Like, I used it today, it's delicious. Honestly, good. Goodness, goodness gracious. Okay, next, I'm gonna show you the V products that I said. I'm wearing that blush today along with a bunch of other things. And the blush I'm wearing today is in Pesca. So these are the blushes. I got Pesca and Piazza. So here's Pesca, and here is Piazza. Pesca, well, let me start here. Piazza is a very like rosy bronze kind of shade. And then the one I'm wearing today, which is Pesca, is just a peach. Very nice, very nice. So this is Vive Cosmetics. Those are the sunset blushes. I got those. And then I also picked up... Oh, Lord, I'm dropping things. Sorry, guys. Um, I also picked up two of the lipsticks. And one of the liners that I thought I had somewhere, but apparently not. Where are you, liner... Sorry, I'm just grabbing it because I forgot all about it and I forgot that I stuck it in here apparently. Yeah, so I picked up a liner in Rumor, a lipstick in Coming In Hot, and a lipstick in Power Suit. So let me show you guys those. So, that is basically what um, Coming In Hot looks like. And then power suit right next to it. Power suit coming in hot. Like just beautiful shades. Power suit is more like orangey. And the coming in hot is like peachy nude. And then also the rumor lip liner. Which is that one right there. It's more like a deep kind of like, I don't know, like brown, berry kind of shade i don't really know how to describe that but yeah i like 
the liner okay. I really love the lipsticks and the blushes, but the liner, I just like it okay. And then as per usual, Luna is here, my dog. And then this is what the Essential palette looks like. She is pretty, you guys, and she's huge. Look it. She's like the size of my head. I have a big head, I guess. <laughs> yeah, anywho. Okay, I picked up those from Vive. Hey, Luna, would you mind? And then from Ulta, I picked up a Urban Decay Hydromaniac Foundation in the shade 30 Light because my skin is hating me. It's super, super dry. And this is very radiant and nourishing and just so hydrating so i love it i also grabbed the elf light 240 warm um camel cc cream this is beautiful it's pretty full coverage and it's gonna be great for the summer spf 30 so i can't wait to keep using these so far i like them i like them a lot those are good stuff there and then i picked up a couple of drugstore concealers from ulta because oh, i needed some I got the Born This Way uh, Radiant Concealer because, again, I'm dry right now. So I got that. And then this is already a wrong shade from the e.l.f. Hydrating Camel Concealer. I got light beige, but I need a shade lighter. This is not light enough for my under eyes. And then I went old school and I got the uh, Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Corrector in the shade 115 Warm Light. Light Warm. I got those. And then I got a Pacifica Wake Up Beautiful Super Hydration Sleepover Mask. I like this. I've used this already. It's really nourishing for nighttime. It's really nice. I like that. And then I picked up... Oh, you know what I got? I got something else. Let me show you guys. Sorry, I'm going to move you guys a little bit again. So to start... I got an Ofra uh, liquid um, liquid blush in Truly. So let me show you what that looks like. Oh Lord, how messy! That's very uh, like wet and juicy. I don't know if that's gonna work for me because well, I just don't know. I just don't know. Yes, Luna, what is your problem? Can you please be calm for once in your life? I would appreciate it, you know. Oh yeah, I was gonna tell you guys. I picked up the new um, collab highlighter from Ofra, the Seth Tom's Milk and Cookies highlighter. I've been using it and I love it. I love it so much. I really do. Mm, it smells sweet, like vanilla. So let me swatch. Let me swatch. So basically. Luna, go. Go, Looney. Go. Sorry, guys. So basically, um, this is what this highlighter looks like. It's very golden and bronzy. Yeah. So this is what they look side by side, each shade, the lighter and the deeper. And then mix together because I've been mixing them. They're stunning, you guys. Stunning. Mix together right there. And then the blush here is the Truly shade, which I don't know if I'm going to, you know, enjoy, to be quite honest with you. But we'll see. We'll see. It just feels like very, um, like, runny and watery. Like, it doesn't have enough of, like, a base to be a cream. And I feel like it's going to run on me. Next, I also picked up a Nude Sticks Nudies um, All Over Face Color. I got the shade in the Nude. Luna. This is like a warm um, peachy nude. I like it. It's like up my alley. As we knew. So, basically, that's what that looks like. And then I also picked up a NARS um, Good Times Velvet Matte Lip Pencil. And that is what the lip pencil looks like by NARS. So, in the Nude Nude Sticks, NARS 
good times and then i got another nars product guys and this is a air matte lip color and this is in the shade thrust so let me show you this is a very like moussey like runny like i don't know it's a very light mushy formula the air matte lip and it's um this top one so um that's in the same shade thrust good times by nars and then nude sticks in the nude like look so so yummy i like that i like those a lot and then i also grabbed another one of these elf um putty blushes i feel like this is gonna be good for the summer this is in um turks and caicos and i have bali i also want to pick up the um maldives oh yes very like bright kind of peachy corally it's right there yeah so probably gonna like that too you know let me wipe those away almost done here guys so yeah last but not least i like um the brand half kate and they came out with some new cream bronzers so i got the shade morning view which is the lightest and then i got coolness which is like the third or fourth shade so this is supposed to be morning view is a neutral and it's for light skin and then the coolness is supposed to be a cool tone so we'll see i'll do the morning view these are dewy cream bronzers and i will say they're very very dewy they are i thought i was gonna like them they feel sticky when you touch them but once they're on the skin and everything it works out great so there's a morning view and then um let me show you coolness basically so let me do a better swatch since i did the big swatch up there i feel like i'm so bright guys there we go and then i look very glowy well i am so there's coolness and morning view and pretty much that was my damage so far i do have more things coming in i picked up some bougie bougie stuff from hermes hermes and I also picked up um, some stuff from uh, Victoria Beckham Beauty because finally that shade Honey from the Lid Lusters came back in stock. And I jumped. I jumped. I've been stocking her. And she hadn't restocked for like a thousand years. But finally came back in stock. So I have more stuff, you know. I'll show you guys eventually when I get all that in. And then I'm still not done. I'm going to see my family this weekend. And I know they're going to be like such sweetie pies and give me a bunch more um gift cards and then the sephora semi-annual sales coming up and so is 21 days of beauty by ulta so you know there's gonna be stuff gonna be stuff and then also pretty much i don't know i ordered a couple things they're in the works so i guess once i have all my stuff in i'll share with you guys and i'll tell you like what i enjoyed next time i don't know maybe i'll do a get ready which i still think that i suck at everything i do here but i just like makeup so much and this is a hobby and so i appreciate any amount of support i get on here i love my influencers i love the beauty community i love anything beauty related i'm just a mommy who you know it's my hobby so yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.